mushrooms ahead of us. And there's gonna be a jump scare right now. I think it's delayed. Jump scare is delayed, definitely. Delayed. Stop! Closing the doors on me. Going down. Emergency stop. No, we weren't. Good old is right that way. So we're going up. This doesn't feel safe. Well, we're not alone. Good to know that we're not alone. I think I would be better off not know what is wrong with that door. It's out of focus. Is it out of focus? Ways, some fine ways. I wouldn't want it myself. No, just that. It looked like the door was painted, like bad, like a bad picture. Out of focus. There's something behind me, isn't it? Yeah, okay, okay. Window, something's, something's happening. Something's gonna bloody happen. The door is open. <sighs> okay. <sighs> what, um, excuse me, but what exactly is going on here? Do I need to sit down? It's a key, and we're... Oh, hello. Dear sir, while I can certainly understand that you are upset and I have nothing but sympathy for your wife and yourself, I must categorically state that I do not wish to receive any further correspondence from you in this matter. Any skin graft procedure is extremely complicated and inherently associated with the risk of failure. Having stated that, I assure you that me and my colleagues at St. Anne have made every effort to ensure a positive outcome for your wife. Personally speaking, I believe that we have done the best job possible considering the extent of tissue damage. You are, of course, entitled to your opinion, and I can certainly understand your disappointment. What I do not understand is how you seem to think writing hateful letters to me or my fellow doctors will ameliorate the situation. As I have already stated, I can certainly understand you've been under a lot of stress of late, and thus I will not press charges if you refrain from any future correspondence. Let me make it absolutely clear that I will not tolerate any further threats aimed at my staff, my family, or myself. If you wish to seek psychological help, I can have my assistant provide contact information of several specialists who would be more than competent to help you get through these hard times. With regards and best wishes for you and your wife, William H. Green, medical degree. Where is the key? There's a jump scare.
I'm just amazed at the music in this game. Like I can I can listen to this for hours. It really calms me down. But it also scares the hell out of me playing this game. But there's a whispering again, like we had with the boss. Why'd you stop? That tune was perfect. Honey, please, just a little longer. At least until I finish painting this one part. Oh, don't make me beg. Painter. Married. A musician. Something's wrong with the canvas. I should end the episode soon, actually. What? 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 Um, isn't that the room I went inside? What? What? I went in. I, what? Uh. The elevator has sunk a little bit. Uh. Oh, stop doing that! Stop slamming the door in my face! Nope. Uh, no. 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 Uh, do, do people do this? Like, build a shelf in the wall like this and have doors? Do, do, do people actually do that? I've never seen it. I've never seen it in movies, TV series, or in real life. This is the actual first time I've encountered this. So my question is, do people actually do that? Okay, that's closed. We need to go upstairs and then we're gonna pr probably try and get in there. Unless the whole bloody place changes on me. Well, something's burning down the... Oh. I have a feeling that I'm supposed to walk over and fall down. Is that a radio? Shut up! Oh, he's gone. Okay, good. He's gone. Nothing, nothing to see here. <laughs> Just had to do that. For the fun of it. Yeah, don't slam the door! What if the ghost just came in and... STOP SLAMMING THE DOOR! <laughs> And then just leave again. <laughs> um, here's the rat again. Wait, maybe? Maybe the rats are trying to tell me something. Warning signs. The following list is a, a compilation of the most common symptoms of schizophrenia. While typically diagnosed between the age of 15 and 25, the disorder is known to affect older patients as well. 
Note that these symptoms are not exclusive to schizophrenia. Wait. Schizophrenia. Okay, and should by no means be treated as exclusive evidence of this particular affliction. In order to obtain a proper diagnosis, you should contact a qualified specialist, i.e. psychologist or a psychiatrist. Warning signs can be such as a blank expression, stares off into space, yes, okay. Involuntary facial movements, yes. Insomnia, haven't noticed. Unusual gestures or postures, always have that. Unable to experience joy from activities, definitely. Depersonalization, what does that even mean? What does it mean? Awkward, clumsy movement, might be from the accident. Prone to anger, resentment, more passive aggressive? Lack of motivation, yes. Suicidal tendencies. Eh? Like, uh, let's see. So there was a rat here. Does will that lead me to? Uh, I was actually thinking that it will lead me to one of those rat pictures, or mice pictures. But it did. Come on. Nothing. Oh, light. Make up your goddamn mind. Okay. Wait. No, I haven't been here. But that. That's the same one. Where's the shadow of oh, this statue? Huh? Is, no, that's a. I don't know. I don't recall the name of that. Uh, some light. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Let's spin this. <laughs> Just cause. Nothing. That's something eating something. That's horrible. More booze. I must fit all the booze. Jesus, there's so much booze here. It's been a hell of a party. Uh. Um, excuse me, but what the hell? Serious. What the hell? Why? Why? Why would you do this? What? What purpose do you have to do this? To make a mess of everything? Once it's fine. Oh. 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 Okay. I guess. Well, thank you for revealing that to me. I guess that that's the reason you had for making a mess of things. Yeah. I much appreciate it. One six five. One. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Wait. How how does this work? No. Nope. Uh, one and how how does that work? One six five. I'm believing that's the one. But I can only do ten at a time. Wait, one and one, two, three, one, two, three, four, 
five, six, one, two, three, four, five. How? Okay, uh, I, you know what? I need to figure out, I'm just gonna Google exactly what I need to do here. Okay, so it's 10, 60, 50, so 10, and then it's this way, 10, 60, and then this way again. Ah, there we go. I've never opened a safe before, so uh, I just had to learn how to open the safe. <sighs> when do the game save? Because I, I really want to just take a break now, but I don't know when the game saves. I'll just we we'll just keep going, and I'll split this session in two. Yes. So let's see. Hello. Oh, jeez, I thought that was a person standing there. So it's midnight. Nothing? Nothing, okay. Are you serious? Why? Why? How about you? Are you gonna... Change? No? Good. Y you stay there. Don't, don't come out of the picture, okay? Just, just stay there. Uh, this place, these pictures. There's a mirror. Are we in the mirror? Can't see myself. Undone. To uh, be undone. It cannot 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 be undone. It really undone. <laughs> Were we in the picture? Or are we now in the picture? Jesus, this game is fucking with my head. Ah, close on me again. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! The sound. <sighs> oh god! No! Don't do that! Don't do that! Shit! Shame on you, game. We're doing that. Don't don't use animals, okay? Oh, I got Terry eyes now. I can't do animals. Remember how you said it would be nice to have a cat so the baby could have someone to play with? Well, I just bought us a dog. <laughs> oh. Did he kill the kitten dog? Was it? Pop. Popeye? Hello? I, I honestly can't tell what it says. Popkel. Poprel. Poptel. Popple. I, I honestly have no clue. Popiel. Popiel. Oh, screw that. Something's behind me right now. You want this as well? I don't want anything! Ooh. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. 
Oh, the old lady from Earth Evil Seven is here. That's the that's the gal we saw in the elevator. Oh, do do do. God damn it! Thank you for watching, guys. I'm ending it here. Goodbye.